Hello everybody out there. How's everybody doing today? I've got kind of a sad Christmas tale to tell you. Something I'd like to get off out there. I get out there and tell the world. And I'm sorry to sound monotonous, but I'm, it's about the girl of my dreams. And I'd like to pour my heart out to Santa. Hey Santa, Mike says, hey, by the way, I'd like to go into this in detail, but I won't because the batteries are about to run. No. Um, but just right quickly, I'd like to say the last few Christmases without the girl of my dreams <laughs> have been not exactly the perfect ones that I really want to share right now. But if anything could represent the loneliness and despair that I have felt over the last few years being without that girl of my dreams, this could represent the magnitude, the level, the size of the loneliness in this stocking. Now to represent the joy and the exuberance I've felt sharing Christmas with that girl of my dreams, this would represent <laughs> this would represent the happiness and the joy. So if there's a girl out there that could possibly change it around. And turn this into the lonely side and this into the exuberant, joyful, holiday, festive side and email me and become that girl of my dreams. Become that the girl. <laughs> Swap me out today and make me feel, make me happy, make me go, baby, go, and I'll get back to you. Just email me. It's Christmas. <laughs> lonely, happy. Lonely, happy. If there's a girl, <laughs> you get the picture. If you'd like to send me a picture, go <laughs> I'm sorry to be so such a downer on Christmas, but I'm just giving it one more try. And by the way, if you are out there and you're starting to email me, that one girl, that one girl of my dreams, as you know, put a little perfume on it before you send it through the airwaves so I know it's you. <laughs> oh, I tried to hold that in, but it was... <laughs> Oh, man!